planner friends welcome back to the channel this is Jan with Jan happy planning and today I have for you a plan with me in my mini gratitude planner from January 24th to the 30th and I will be using mainly uh, some washi tape from the washi tape shop I have recently recently um, purchased um, these guys uh, which are now um, these are washi um, stickers basically like so I'll have to put this one here and it comes in strips and you just pick the ones you like um, and uh, you could of course use the whole strip but um, you pick the ones you like and then the flowers and the butterflies some of them are attached to the scene I'll show you in a minute other ones you have to just cut and then separate from the backing um, I have a little piece um, from here that I will um, cut around the flowers and then uh, place it here So um, I also have this one, which is more like an autumn um, a vibe in it. And then this one has, I'll show you because I have taken quite a few. Um, this one has a little bit of spring. It's beautiful. I've taken some of here. Uh, and some of here. I might take more. Um, it depends how many I'm going to fit and I am also going to use some washi tape from the happy planner um, I have already selected the ones I think I'm going to use here to give it a, a, a ground level I might cut this out uh, to include them I use this tool uh, which is from my book binding uh, times uh, it's an owl and you punch uh, but this is very good for the um, the washes that have a backing from the washi tape shop or any other shop um, it makes it much easier to uh, remove and I have this the quote here that comes from wild style right at the back uh, so um, yeah that will be the quote for um, this week so I'm just going to start with the washi and I normally put my uh, decoration here on notes because I do not really use it for anything else. Um, I just do my entries uh, on a daily basis for, um, for my gratitude. So um, I tend to do the um, decoration in there um, because I really need the space for uh, the rest of the days. When I upgrade to um, a classic size, then it will be different. I can I can dedicate more um, more time for. Um, or more space for decoration so let's see how this is going to pan out I think what I want to do is cut this out because he's trying to get into the planter like many cats we will be using the planter but this chap is going to go here like so and then this one who is sleeping there uh, atop the books we want to place him here he's right in the line there which is fine 
this guy has these butterflies and is playing with them. So they're just sort of that's too close. It does have quite a bit of a strong blue. I need to get the uh, the feet right. Okay, that is not good. I think I have to lift this one because the whiskers are behind the butterflies. Need to get my bone folder to flatten here in between the two, and then the idea was to but it might not work because. First of all, these guys are much bigger. And then this guy needs a little bit more wash. Um, yeah, a strip of wash to come up here, I think. I can sacrifice that little bit of... Um, Wash over there. I, I mean the space. I can sacrifice a little bit of the space and write here. On Sundays I tend not to really write too much. Um, I always go for an average of 50 words. Um, so it will be interesting or I can do here. Or I could just do I love this too but I have plenty of spreads to work with this one so I'm just going to bring these ones back which is this and there is the one here I could put this one here or I could put this one on the chair which is funny it's very very funny I think I'll use this one I think I'll bring it down a little bit Yeah, like that. So what we can do now is um, we're going to bring this. No, it's too. It needs to be slightly higher. So let's see. These are these tiny flowers that can be used later. I think I'll use it here. And then um, these tiny um, I could do a butterfly on this side. Well, there are two butterflies here. So I just need to cut around. And then I will separate it with my owl. Very handy tool. 
haven't used it um, in a long time. I think it was probably about four years ago that I did my last binding. And it has come in handy with, um, with separating these um, stickers. And there is a red one here, we can also cut it off. And remove it. And stick it down. And I am not sure whether Yeah, I don't know about the rest. Let me see. <sighs> there is one other one. We could do... I do have a great pin. find it man but I know that I have a marker so I'm gonna use that so I'm going to use this chap We can still see it's Thursday. But we're going to make it hanging. So it's a hanging basket. And that should be all right. Maybe a little dot at the top. It's going to be very, yeah, that's not bad. So I think that is it for my decoration of my gratitude. I know it's very minimalistic. Oh, I haven't finished it. Um, I know it's very minimalistic, but um, this is how I am um, using it. And unfortunately, I cannot give you a uh, sneak peek of um after the pen because it's very um it could work either or um i kind of like it here I'm going to put it down and then see if I like it there. Okay, I think I'm going to leave it. No, because January is already there, so I'm going to just center it slightly here. 
let's see what it will work okay Yeah, I think I like it. I could, of course, do a lot more. Um, I could, for example, I know I said that I was almost, or I said this is it, but now I'm changing my mind. And we get the owl. And yeah, that's not bad. It's a little bit of a detail here and there. Um, it's nice. Sorry, I go a bit silent, I always do, um, and on top of it, all oh, today I, it's getting bit almost, it's almost gone actually. I woke up with uh, a little bit of a headache, so, um, yeah, I think I have two more but I think I'm going to leave it as is yeah I think I'll leave it as is um, I'm very I'm very pleased with how it turned out um, I'm going to put it in my planner and I'll show you how that is looking so this is it this is how i look in my planner um in my gratitude planner from january the 24th to the 30th uh with i believe it's called um chunky cat set it's a set of four it's this one uh plus um an arrow it's also um uh, backing I'll show you um, a sneak peek of it. I haven't swatched this one yet. Um, it's like so. Um, it has beautiful florals. Um, and ooh. I like it. I'm going to put it over January because I... It's not yeah I'm I'm going to put it's I'm going to see whether it works because I'm going to take the page off and I'll be back with you Okay, so we have uh, this one here. I want to bring it all the way to there or maybe to the polka dots. It's, it has this slight design there. You will be able to see um, January. So that is not an issue.
but I think I'll leave January out. I am not sure whether it will rip, so it's better if I just take my um, exacto knife. I'm just going to do it at an angle. Let me see. No, I don't like it. Um, I think it's because um, the hanging basket is here. But no, I'll I'll use this one to get a um. Oh, it's ripped the page a little bit. And a little bit more this um this is the issue with this um the ones i have a backing have very strong glue um it damaged a little bit of uh, the page there but it doesn't matter um i had to try it so um yes this is part of it and it's called as i have mentioned chunky cat set it's a set of four and um it's available at uh, right now at the washi tape shop so and um, this is it this is the final look uh for the week and thank you so much for watching if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you like to see any more of my future videos please consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell i will be seeing you on my next one bye